Welcome to Black and Gold Today, brought to you by Ray Brandt Infinity. I'm Rachel Whitaker. Great to have you join me on this Monday. The Saints now have nine new players, thanks to a completely full NFL draft. And they sent their message loud and clear. Upgrade the defense. When you load up at cornerback and linebacker, you've got goals in mind. So let's look at their six newest defenders. Linebackers Stefan Anthony, Haoli Kikaha, and Davis Tull, cornerbacks PJ Williams and Damian Swan, and defensive tackle Tyler Davison. Sean Payton said third rounder Williams and fifth rounder Swan will compete at corner. You know, we're, we're seeing a lot more sub offenses now and, and we just feel like we need to, you know, stack that position. Um, I know the in immediate question is you start penciling names in, um, where do they all fit? And, and really the true honest answer to that is we're going to see. We're going to, you know, have them out there and create the competition and, and look at guys. I would say this, the two players that we drafted um, this year, the two players we just drafted, we think have versatility and, 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 and a makeup and a, a skill set that can play inside if need be. Um, both of them are guys that are around the ball a lot. Both of them are guys that, that everyone would describe as guys that have good football instincts and that can handle more than just one spot. Now Anthony was a true inside linebacker in the draft. And the Saints also addressed the pass rush with Kikaha and Tull on the outside. Now Tull had surgery on a torn labrum in April, which Peyton said probably dropped him lower. You know, the yellow for us means, uh, you know, he's going to rehab an injury. It's going to be fully re repaired and healthy. Uh, and yet that first rookie camper, he, he potentially he's not going to be involved in some of the early stuff. He's going to, now for him, he's a quick study, he's smart. He's a really good learner. But, you know, you, you got to look at your grade and say, all right, we're willing to wait a little bit. You know, this guy's got a real good skill set. We'll look at offense when we come back. Am I missing a deadline? Will I get there in time? Am I going too fast? Did I close the garage door? Stay in your lane. I don't think I sent that email. I should make a reservation. I thought it was clear. Okay, break. I didn't see that coming. Its instinct to protect leaves you free to drive. Welcome back. No, Saints fans, this is not the end for quarterback Drew Brees just because Colorado State's Garrett Grayson was drafted Friday. Their large number of draft picks opened the door to get him, and Mickey Loomis said he'll challenge Luke McCown and Ryan Griffin. In terms of the evaluation, the background, uh, all the things that you look for, it just seemed like every box uh, was checked in, in, in terms of a quarterback, um, you know, that you want that you want to uh, help develop. And so, then you know, we went out, we worked him out, and uh, had a great visit with him. And and look, he's a good candidate for us. And and. Um, you know, I like the fact that we have another guy in the mix with, with Luke and Ryan, uh, who, who we think a lot of both of those players as well. So how can first round pick Andrew Pete crack the lineup at tackle? Loomis said he and the rookies will earn their right. We're not against them playing right away. We're looking for contributions to our team, but that's not always, that doesn't always mean that they're going to start. You know, they're going to, they're going to play when they're ready to play and that they're, they've earned the, uh, earn the right to play and so um, I do think that and I said it I think our expectations for rookie players are, are uh, unrealistic for the most part uh, I think it's an exception when when a rookie comes in and and, and uh, um, you know does spectacular things and yet we seem to have that expectation for every certainly every first round pick we'll have much more on the draft coming up tomorrow thanks for watching